Boogie drop that beat. Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, Talking Out Loud with Miss Talkative. Everything I say is my own opinion, alleged, and strictly entertainment purposes. Remember, I'm just talking out loud. Please like, share, subscribe, comment on the video, let me know what you think. Now, I know by now, everybody knows that Jeezy is divorcing Jenny Ma. Uh, when I tell you all, I don't feel sorry for either one of them. I really don't. Now, it's being said that Jenny is trying to uh, fight for her marriage, and my question is why? I don't, I don't understand what... what what's there to fight for my mom always told me don't let no man tell you he don't want you more than once now i applaud Jeannie for wanting to fight for her marriage and she wanted her marriage but what does uh what does we as women women always say when we suspect our man of cheating or you know doing something or not being attentive to the marriage and um, and so before they start stepping out, um, or when we catch them, what do we always say? We always say, you could have told me that you didn't want to be with me no more. Or you, uh, we could have dissolved this marriage. You could have told me that you wanted out. Um, so, so, uh, you know, we always say, don't have me out here looking stupid and you out here tricking or, you know, doing you. So. Jeezy has spoken and he has said he has made moves to uh, move the um, divorce along and he has, I mean, so he's told her he don't want her and me, myself, I'm not fighting for no man that, um, that will pull a, a stunt like this. Jeezy had the paperwork drawn up way before he filed and made the announcement so to me a man like that i couldn't trust no more that's not that's not her man and i hate the fact that there was a baby involved but that's not that's not genie's man because a man that truly loves you or a man that's worth fighting for is not one that will pull a stunt like this he went and filed paperwork and held on to it I can't trust him with nothing. My life, nothing. There's, there's no more trust there. And so, the, um, she wound up reconciling with this man. And as soon, every time they get into a fight or an argue, I mean, well, you know, I mean, argument or whatever. Um, but every time they get into it, first thing he gonna say is, "You wanted this. You, I wanted out, and you wanted this." And then slowly but surely, she's gonna be losing parts and bits of herself. To this man trying to morph into something that she really don't want to be. Let this man go while you can still remain whole. Because as soon as, um, oh, well, my thing is if they reconcile and he starts, you know, uh, using it against her to uh, knock her down a notch and taking her self esteem, telling her she wanted it, he didn't want it. She, and when she really do want out, she's going to be too scared to get out because she's been there so long and she don't want the criticism of you should have divorced him when you had the chance. You should have let him go when he wanted to go. So she'll probably stay in it longer than she needs to be. But because he pulled this stunt, it's time to go. This is not your man. Like I say, Jeezy knew exactly what, um, he knew what and who he was getting. He knew it exactly what he was doing, in my opinion. He sought after her um, and, you know, uh, pursued her to fit his needs at the time. And once those obligations were met, he no, he no longer needed her. He wanted people to, um, to believe that, um, you know, his image had changed. He needed her to build his image up to help him sell that book. He wanted to appear more mainstream, in my opinion, instead of a hood or a gangster man. And he wanted people to believe he had another side to him. But in my opinion, he don't. Jeezy gonna be who Jeezy is 
And his pattern, in my opinion, has not changed since he left Keisha Cole. Repeat, rinse, recycle. And that's Jeezy. He repeats the steps of lying to women, you know, uh, having them fall in love with him and, you know, making their expectations of, you know, uh, wanting to settle down with him. He gets them basically um, to fall in love with him. And then he, uh, when he gets what he needs, he walk away. And then he, he, you know, just rinse himself off by walking away. And then he repeats the cycle with the next woman. Yeezy going to be who Yeezy is. And I don't expect nothing less, nothing more. But I don't think that Jenny Ma really took a look at Jeezy to know who he is and what he's about. She was so hung up on the fact that the dark piece of meat that she actually um, was that she actually said that she wanted only on the side that the uh, that he wanted to be her main course. Jenny fell heart first when she should have used her head because what was the rush to get married and, and have a baby? When you went, um, you know, Jenny, you know, kept saying over and over, over and over, I'm sorry. Jenny went over, um, she always stated she didn't want no kids and for her to meet a man and you know start having um treatments to uh conceive why why now what's the rush jenny in my opinion should have listened to herself and thought about why she really made those two statements what was uh, what was she going through at the time to make herself say that she didn't want no kids and why did she say she only wanted her dark meat on the side I don't believe nothing has changed. I don't believe that nothing had changed. She, uh, she was just so infatuated and hung up on the fact that now her dark meat wanted to be her main course. People keep trying to, you know, guess who fault it is. But in my opinion, it was bound to end sooner or later because if you haven't taken time to fix yourself before you move into a serious relationship, then it's headed for destruction on sight. And... You know, Jeezy talking about he don't want the uh, he don't want the marriage, and he's made moves to end it. Jenny, I say go ahead and pick your face up off the floor, put your big girl panties on, and make your demands known. Get your divorce, move on in life, and you know just do a fantastic job at co-parenting. That's just my opinion. I'm just talking out loud. Please like, share, subscribe, comment on the video. Let me know what you think.